guys, this is Disney Cars Toy Club, and today we're going to be showing you the Fashion Time Bridal Fashion Designer. And we have Queen Elsa here to model all of the wedding dresses that we make. Alright, so this kit comes with two mannequins, fabrics, ribbon, and instructions, and it says that there is no cutting or sewing necessary. So let's open it up and see what's in the box. So this package has all of the fabric and the ribbons in it. There's some sequins, some lace, see some sparkly stuff in there. And then here are the two mannequins. And I think these are necklaces. And the set of instructions. Go ahead and open everything up and get started. Okay, so here are all of our supplies. Now, the way that these mannequins work is that you take the fabric and twist it around the back of the mannequin. And then use the little spatula that comes with it to tuck the fabric into the slit that is in the back of the mannequin. So that is how you actually create the dress. And then you just build layers of that. So what we'll do is we will create the different dresses on the mannequins and then we can transfer those over to Queen Elsa. So that is how the form works. It's pretty neat. Okay, so we will get started with our first dress. This fabric is slippery. <laughs> okay, so we'll press that into the back of the mannequin. Okay, so here is our first dress. And here is Queen Elsa modeling our first wedding dress. Okay, now we'll start dress number two.
here's dress number two. Now Queen Elsa just needs a prince. And I'm ready to start our third dress and I have just started by putting the fabric around the mannequin. And I thought I would try to do something kind of fancy for the top. So we'll see how that goes. <laughs> And we can do another overlay of fabric around the bottom. And then we will do some silver ribbon around the waist. There we have our third dress, and we can get our model Queen Elsa to model that for us now. Here is Queen Elsa in our third dress. I can't decide which one is my favorite. And I also made Anna a dress because I didn't want her to feel left out. <laughs> and I put a little bit of lace on Olaf so he wouldn't feel left out either. And I even tried to make Queen Elsa a veil. So maybe this is what she would look like when she gets married. Okay guys, that's all we have for today. If you'd like to see more videos with Queen Elsa and Princess Anna, click the like button. And tell me in the comments which dress was your favorite. I think mine was the third one, but I like the second one a lot too. And I think Anna's turned out cute. For more Disney Cars, Play-Doh, and Surprise Toy Fun, check out our channel. Please subscribe, and thanks for watching.